Aaron? Aaron! Aaron, honey, did you really oversleep again? You said this wasn't gonna be a problem again after spring break. Did you even set the alarm? Ugh, five more minutes. Come on, Aaron. You didn't do anything besides sleep this entire spring break. I don't think you left this room more than three times all week. Okay, honey, just for my peace of mind, I want to check on you before class starts this morning. Do you feel like you might have a fever? Maybe a cough or runny nose? What? No, Mom, I'm not sick. Okay, but you really need to get moving. School starts at 7.45. Plenty of time. Oh, and in case I'm still in the shower by the time you're ready, the password to my laptop is Stranger Danger 1972 exclamation point. All lowercase, all one word. Why would I need to bring your work computer to school? but to varying degrees throughout the country. So, for example, when you talk about the kinds of mitigation issues that we have put forth and have emphasized, just as I mentioned the other day, there are two dynamic forces that are going on at the same time. You're having the natural course of an outbreak strategy. Mom, I'm going to head to school now. Bye. You've mentioned that multiple times. Mom. Oh, Where were you last night, Dad? Oh, screw it! Out for a jog here and honey? What? Stay safe, we're all in this together! What? I don't see any China flu around me! These muscles are a violation of my First Amendment rights! We will not hide! Yes! Yes, there we go! Keep running free, young woman! Don't be a chief! <laughs> Thank you very much, Mr. President, Mr. Vice President. What I want to do just over the next minute or so is maybe connect some of the dots of the things that you've heard today. First, the status of the dynamics of the, of the outbreak. I mean, you all know the numbers, you've seen them. 
we have widespread infection, but to varying degrees throughout the country. So, for example, when you talk about the kinds of mitigation issues that we have put forth and have emphasized, just as I mentioned the other day, there are two dynamic forces that are going on at the same time. You're having the natural course of an outbreak trying to peak at a high level, and then you have the mitigation strategies which are aimed at dampening that. We've mentioned that multiple times. We often get asked, how do you know you're having an effect? Because there are two things that are going on at the same time. They may be confounding. Well, I can tell you for sure, from a public health standpoint and experience with other outbreaks, we know we are clearly having an effect, but we can't...